What is up, guys? This is Pinzo back with another video today. And what I have for you guys is some Narbash. Narbash is one of my favorite supports to play. And the reason for that is that just his kit really incentivizes your team to group up, which is something that in solo queue, your team doesn't do very well, right? There's a lot of times where people are out here getting picked or over here taking 1v1s or whatever, right? And Narbash's kit really incentivizes your team to stand on top of Narbash, get heals, get movement speed, right? Wait for some, wait for him to thunk somebody. And it oftentimes allows you as the Narbash player to kind of pilot your team around the map. Where you walk, they walk. And it's really easy to get your team to go to objectives and take towers and group up on people and, you know, take a 3v1, gank somebody with a good gank and get a kill. And uh, it's a really easy, fun way to play support. So hopefully you guys enjoy. If you do, leave a like, comment, subscribe. But we'll jump right into it. Oh, that the worst thunk of my life. Don't worry about that thunk. We hit, we hit every other thunk. Got the one rough one out of the way of my first Narbash game in like eight months. He was going to hit two and run at me, so I got to be careful. I mean, Steel's a pretty good lane to play Narbash into, at least. The Steel used an ability yet, bro. This guy's just kind of staring. Kind of a spectator. They saw our Grux, so they're just playing back, but you know, this is fine. Nice. Good combo, Wraith. Exactly what we want. That's huge. It's a lot of poke. The second health pot, too. Bad thunk. Don't worry about that. Oh, he hits the combo anyway. He's just that guy, man. He's that guy. I need to wait for uh, the combo, for a Wraith combo to come back up. Need to give it a second. Okay, that's fine. I don't want to stand in front of him for his dash, but nice, huge damage. Oh, this guy started blue buff on Fang now. Interesting. Wouldn't recommend in jungle. Well, orb is kind of painful to stack in the jungle, but oh, that's unfortunate. Whoa. I was unfortunate that Wraith got stuck in the tower there. That was a really good steel wall. Unfortunate my thunk went through, but it blocked the uh, the the Wraith Q. Contact, contact. And they don't have steel wall for another 10 seconds still. Like, nice. That it, that one that one's kind of free. I don't I don't know exactly what that guy was doing. Oh, nice snipe. I have thunk. Like we're good. This dude can't run us down the lane. I don't want to just take a base. Playing tonight in the no, not in the uh, not in the thing. Not what it what's it called? Uh, the the Friday night. Lights or whatever. I don't know what the what the thing is called, but no, I'm not playing in the Friday night thing tonight. We have we have just other scrims tonight. Steel looking like a paid actor. No, he just looks like someone who doesn't know how to play steel support. Whether or not he's good at steel, I, I can't really tell. He just does not I does not look like he knows how to play him in support. Let's flash for flash. I want to just, I just want to make sure I'm on minion aggro here. That was flash for flash on the uh, TV, and we have a giant freeze. Bro, 
Friday Night Showdown? Is that what it's called? Okay. Then yes, I'm not playing in that. Up the lane. Come up the lane. I mean, that's fine. Like, he's hitting me, but I am just kind of narbash. This is a okay. Okay. Bobber not doing the build. He's not. Oh, he's going Alcrod. What? What is he building, though? I see he's not going the build, but what is he building? Does not make me have less questions about the build. Rip ping gap on Thunk. That actually killed me. He should probably die. Oh, rip one snipe. Oh. I didn't think that was going to kill me. Kind of surprised. Ping gapped on Thunk. I'm oh, good. Don't max E. I wanted to put a couple points into Thunk just because I think this is going to be an aggressive lane and I want more stuns. But uh, now I'm going to max E. Like after I get my ult, I'll max E. I just want to make sure I have my stun every time my Wraith has his combo. All right. Uh, can I get a high ward here? I think I can. Three is up. Steel's not in lane. Kind of just want to run at this guy, honestly. Nice, Wraith. Big. That's exactly what I wanted to do. As soon as I see Steel in mid, I just want to. I just want to run at this dude. Just got his dash. Okay, I didn't catch his dash. Okay. All right, predecessor. Yeah, all right. Great game we got here. Okay. And I got his wall for walking at him. If he's going to do that every time, then that's going to be really easy to get his wall for free. I want to stick around for my full item, but it's better if I just base with my Wraith. Just keep our backs on the same timer. Fine. Got good. Go over what the character's abilities do. The uh, Q is just movement speed. Gives move speed to everyone around you. His E is a toggle heal. Turn it on. It sucks mana to heal. Uh, right click is just a one-person stun. You throw out a little drumstick, it stuns somebody. Um... And then his ultimate, he bangs on his drum, it slows everybody, and then uh, it does damage, and then at the end of the duration, it knocks everyone up. And his passive just makes all of his abilities better the more he uses abilities. Like, he's kind of like a, com he's almost a combo-oriented character, where you just want to be using abilities all the time, because it makes your abilities stronger the more you use them. Oh! Actually, just got a huge fucking backstep on that steel ultimate. Trying to save mana so that I have a stun. I just whiffed it. That's okay. Alright, well, uh, that wasn't awesome, but. What was that? One for one? No, two for one. We did we kill? No, we did. Did we kill the steel? No, we didn't kill the steel. One for one. Your skill rises. 
Nice teamwork there. That was, it was good. I got, a, again, like that steel ult, I got a really nice back step. Made my Grux live for a really long time, actually. Because I got a triple knock up in the middle of that. Okay, doke. I'm fine. Like, I can stay. I heal a lot off of my support. I'm about to have two stacks on support crest. I don't know if we win this. They don't have steel ult, but I don't know if we win. It's full mind razor. He just is going to perma shove wave. Oh, my wraith got the gold buff. He just typed it. Got me with that. Okay. Is he gonna flash me? Is he gonna flash queue me? No. I would have flash queued me. I grab a crystal tier. I think I will just go wellspring second. This item's OP. Oh, are they gonna get oh that's steel dunk? My Grex might just be dead. This build. Citadel first item. Uh, I don't know about that one, Chief. Okay, that's actually crazy. I guess Narbash ult range is not the same as uh, his E range. I just never know that. I thought Narbash ult range was the same range as his E. Because that dude was in my, my healing aura. It was like, I could, I mean, you can see the visual. Nice. I think we're cooked. If she kills me, that's fine. Okay, she ulted me. That's fine. That's honestly what I wanted. I wanted her to have to ult me. As soon as I lived through the bomb combo, I just want her to have to ult me to kill me. Oh, good flash. He might be out. He doesn't have stun yet. She's only got bomb. Oh, he juked out. He juked to death. He, ju he juked too hard. But he's dead too. Outplayed. I don't mind the ultimate there. Again, she uses it on the support, bro. That means she didn't have it for the Wraith. Like, realistically, that he should have lived there. Just got a little greedy. But, like, if she wants to ult me, bro, go for it. By all means, ult me. Actually, just does not matter. Again, that you guys are all you guys are all fucking molding about Bellica because you guys watch Soul Reaper and like that's actually none of the issues right there. Like both of my teammates killed themselves, dude. That was nothing to do with Bellica. My Wraith and my Fae both killed themselves there. It was not that was not Bellica diff. That was my teammates didn't know how to run away diff. It's, I mean, it's just eat. Hello, Steel. I mean, I'll, I'll use that combo anytime just for damage. I know that, like, that's on the steel, but it kind of, like, it's still, like, we just chunked that guy. He's Fire Blossom. Okay, steel Rift Walkers being didn't do anything. Nice, good kill. I missed. Nice. I also know that I said I was going to max heal second, and then I didn't. <laughs> I kind of forgot, and I just kept putting points into Thunk. Knock. 
her ult wasn't a, pro a lock on, I probably live. No, I think she hits me. I mean, I was very clearly just gonna drop off that ledge and try and run away. I mean, I think that's a it's like that's a very aimable ult for her. Not like I was doing some crazy. Not like she hit me mid flash or anything, right? Like she probably still hits that. Do it, Steel. Go in. Dash me. Dash me. Here for you, Grox. I got you, baby. Are the big ass buff diamonds icons supposed to be that big now? On the left side of my screen, are they bigger than normal? They look normal to me, but I, I guess I don't know. I don't really pay attention to it. Like, I, I feel like I generally know what is applied to me and what isn't, so I don't really pay attention to the left side of my screen. Also, someone's mowing their lawn outside, so hopefully you guys can't hear that. Really hoping you guys cannot hear it. All right, we are going to have to kill the bell eventually. That's going to be a problem. Thought they might be on five camp. TB has really good jungle clear with Mind Razor, so they could they could pull our camps. In a base. Or can they put the sprays from the bundles into the store separately? It's a good question. I would kind of guess no. The feeling I got was that those were kind of exclusives for those bundles, so that would be my guess. But I I, I don't know. They could. When is the patch? It is April eleventh. Next Thursday. Oh, a huge Grux pull. Nice. Well done, feller. There are carries that work in offlane. I mean, you can do it, but it's mostly... Carries working in offlane is mostly taking advantage of bad offlaners is usually what it is. Like, they don't really work. If you're playing a carry against a good offlaner, like, they'll probably beat you. Murdoch is probably the best one. Murdoch and Twin Blast are, like, the, the best two for offlane carries, but I wouldn't really call them good. I'm trying to catch up to Lobber. He's too fast. I couldn't catch him to speed him in. He was out of speed range. Oh, kill that guy. Nice. That's huge. That's a giant, that's a ginormous shutdown for my Wraith. Like a 4-0 shutdown for that guy. Rip. Didn't get the ward. Imagine they'll be for sale eventually. I, I mean, I will see. I think it'd be cool. Like some of this, like those, uh, just the... Roll sprays, right, is what they are. I think those sprays are pretty good. Like, they're nothing crazy, obviously, right? But, like, they're solid. They're solid sprays. Okay. All right. Nice. We're livers, baby. Prime, dude, I'm actually down to pull this. We have Narbash, like we can pull this early. I'm Narbash with a lot of healing. I am in fact Narbash with many, many healing. Like, I have Crystal tier too, so... We just... I, I don't know, man. We actually heal a lot off of this. And we shred it with Crystal tier. When a lot of rates damage on objectives is abilities, and I'm giving him ability haste, that's pretty good. How's it going, Yiz? What up, dude? What else do I want? I mean, I maybe just... 
go tainted. I could go a defense item. True silver might not be bad. I could just go moon boots. I'll just go moon boots. We ball, bro. Pork and rice bowl after the gym is pure bliss. Dude, I, I, I love, like, eating real food. Like, I don't eat out very much, but when I do, I'm I, I'm always like, I don't know, man. I should have just cooked. I should have cooked at home. Yeah, they're all going on, my dude. I'm going to try and get this pushed. We should be able to get this tier two. They sent a bunch of people to uh, left to deal with our Countess, so. You know, I, I, I do heal minions. I am healing up our minions. Okay. Well, there's four people here now. Is that Sarath solo? It is. What the fuck? Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Oh, that's unfortunate. Faye's just dead. Good stasis, you're still dead. Good flash, you're still dead. She's never killing that guy. I don't know. I don't really like her build, but... He's never killing that guy. Our bash heals minions? Yes, he does. It's not uh, very noticeable, but yes, he does. What is the Countess build? Okay. He's going like a normal kind of burst damage Countess build. All right. Well, we got the prime, then we kind of threw it away. We kind of just did nothing with it, but we did get the prime, so they don't have prime. So much sweat in one player. Can Narf heal my broken heart heartbreak? Yes, thank you for the eight monther. Uh yes, I think Narbash could do that. I do think Narbash could do that. Got a tier two. I mean we all died for the tier two, that's the main issue. We probably should have just run away after we got the tier two. Like, our Countess died, so we knew their whole team was going to come to us after they killed her. We should have just got the tier two and run away. Speed those minions in. Oh, no. Our team is fighting way before we get here. This is bad. Okay, that's fine. We're, we're so fast. Damn. Well done. Good good play from my Wraith. He's just hitting all of his shit. We just get Fang off of that. We did, we did. Unfortunately, we don't get a whole lot. All of our waves are pushed into us, so. But that was good. My Grux got a knock up on the uh, steel right when he tried to Rift Walkers. That was pretty nice. My Wraith is just killing everybody. That's pretty nice. Uh, I don't know. We're fast as fuck. We have double move speed right now. And I've got the out of combat Galaxy Greaves move speed. I don't think we ever catch this guy. That's her flash. I want a base. I want I have I have moon boots in hand. Yeah, we should all just leave. There's no reason for us to stay out right now. Like there's no reason for us to just sit up there. Uh what do I want? Could maybe even go giant's ring, honestly. I'm gonna do it. 
Makes my ult bigger and it uh, gives me some pretty good defense. Gives me more thunks. Most even game you've seen. Uh, this is a pretty good game. And then I think I'll go wind color last. I have a, I have a decent amount of ability haste. Right. 50 with, uh, with crystal tier active. Almost infinite on the heals. I speed this guy if he wants to go in. There we go. I'm coming, county. Oh no! The Sarah just caught blocked by fucking stun! You aren't you cannot you can't run. I'm twice as fast as you, man. Oh shit, I have moon boots. I forgot I had moon boots. Yeah, okay, he's inting for me. He's just running at me. He's getting hit by everything because he, he wants to run at me. It should be free prime. Oh shit, a Feng Mao. Run! I. Oh shit, wait, oh my god, my Wraith is a gamer. Dude, my Wraith is a Giga Chad. Holy shit. This is Fiki, right? I'm pretty sure this is Fiki. Who knew Fiki was a was just that guy? I didn't. I'm gonna be honest. I didn't know Fiki was that guy. He's him, dude. He's him. He's him. He's actually him. Timothy James Charles. Junior the third or something like that Are more of a healer like FaZe or a healer similar to Muriel? Well, Muriel doesn't have healing in her kit, right? She's a shielder Muriel all of Muriel's healing comes from Wellspring the item uh, He's closer to FaZe, but he's much more of like he's 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 like a battle cleric Right like that. That's really what I would call Narbash. He's not really like a healer He's more of like a like a like a cleric. Okay. Nice. Cooked. I don't care if she goes on me. Like I have physical defense right now. I'm actually she doesn't kill me super easy. Ouch. A TB ult kinda hurt though. Oh, he was so close on that snipe. Oh, oh, I thought that Q was going to get that guy. Oh, yeah, I see, I see you, Wraith. We're going in. Bonk. The moon boots up. The thunk from the, the thunk from the sky. Do, 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 do. Narb is the healiest. I mean, Narb is like a real healer. Like, FaZe is a pocket character, right? You pick one person that, that you pocket and you can heal them, right? Narbash heals the whole team. He speeds the whole team. He's very much like a team enchanter. Uh, Zap, you are late to the party on that. Bro, I have 22 assists out of 29 kills on the team. It's pretty good. <laughs> 